G'day guys. Well, you will never guess where I am. I'm actually in Western Sydney, and this is where all mongrel boots are actually made. And I'm here to get fitted out with a brand new set of mongrel boots so I can hit the road on the next season of filming for Pat Callanan's 4x4 Adventures. Now, I have never been here before, so I'm a little bit intrigued to see what it looks like inside. And I've got to say that I'm also a little bit proud of the fact that these boots are made in Australia, an absolute rarity these days. And I know a lot of you guys really want to support Aussie made products at the moment, so I'm thrilled to have these guys on board as a sponsor. been mongrel boots. What was it called beforehand? Uh, the business was and is still called Victor Footwear and we've been making boots in Australia since 1930. 1930? Yeah. So you'd be third generation? Or Fifth, generation. Fifth generation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. My grandfather still works in the business today. Okay, right. So now we are in Regent's Park in Sydney. Um, Basically, this is the heart and soul of manufacturing for Mungle Boots. Yeah, yeah, so all of our boots are made here. Uh, we purpose-built this factory in 2009, uh, and it includes manufacturing, warehousing, and our office as well. Okay. So all the manufacturing is done in-house. Wow. And there wouldn't be too many boot manufacturers left in Australia? No, nah, no, there's not many left at all. So there's about sort of two or three left. Uh, but yeah, we're pretty proud to be Australian made and I think a big part of that has come from my grandfather and from the family who've come before me uh, with a bit of a commitment to staying Australian made and being a bit different to the other brands. Yeah, for sure. Now in terms of the styles, um, what, what are you seeing is, is popular these days um, in terms of the actual yeah, style of the boot? Yeah, zip siders are very popular. So we introduced the first zip side boot into the market in 2006 uh, and they've just grown since then. But still your very traditional style, like the elastic sided boot, uh, you just can't sort of kill it. It's just a staple of Australian life, especially in the bush. Um, and then also lace ups and shoes make up the rest of our product range. But definitely zip siders and elastic sides are sort of clearly out ahead in terms of sales. Yeah, okay. Now Phil, I've got to say that I gave my son Angus a pair of brand new mongrel boots. He slid them on and he just got this massive grin from ear to ear on his face and he said, these things are just so damn comfortable. What is it about it? How do you actually create that comfort in the sole? So it's a combination of two things, the, the design and also the quality of materials. Uh, but our boots are very well known for their comfort. We figure, it, you know, a lot of guys here wearing boots 10, 12, 14 plus hours a day. Uh, and comfort is one of the biggest factors. Uh, you need to stay comfortable on your feet, whether you're uh, out on the farm, you're, you're on a building site working, or you know, you're even on tracks on the weekend. Uh, so we do put a lot of effort uh, and engineering that goes into the, the quality and the comfort of the boots, especially the underfoot comfort. Um, and like I said, that is sort of done through a couple of ways, uh, but definitely high quality polyurethane material. Right, okay, okay. And uh, I noticed the Vibram on some of the soles? Yeah, yeah, so our rubber soles, we've sort of, we've collaborated with Vibram uh, to design a, especially design a rubber outsole for our rubber sole range of boots. So they're an Italian company, which is the world leader in, in rubber outsoles and quite well known in the outdoor uh, side, or out, outdoor industry, hiking, camping, that sort of stuff. Okay. And uh, you're doing a few dress boots these days as well. Yeah, yeah, we have a riding boot, which is quite popular. Um, also modelled off our Victor, some of our Victor riding boots from back in the 1990s. Uh, so we sort of have everything covered from work to dress and everything in between. Town boots, we call them as well. Uh, brilliant, mate. Well, uh, look, I am uh, absolutely thrilled to be putting them through a pretty big road test this season as we're heading out on season 14. Got my brand new mongrels ready to go and hit the tracks because these things really are, they're kind of like, I mean, you have all-terrain tyres for your vehicle. I think you need all-terrains on your soles as well so you don't take a stack when you're checking out that beautiful gorge in the Kimberley as I'm going to head to do. So, mate, thanks so much for, uh, you know, supporting the show and, and also... I'd encourage people, you know, everyone talks about buying Australian made, but I'll tell you what, you can really do it with Mungle. The entire range has that Australian made badge on it. So uh, I'd really encourage you when you're setting up for your next adventure to get out there and uh, check out the Mungle range. Thanks for your time, Phil. No worries. Thanks, Pat.